This episode, we're hunting for the tastiest tacos. And you guys told us of a spot in Wicker Park called Takeda Kitchen that's serving them up with a modern twist. And you know what I always say, feeding tacos is wrong, I don't want to be right. Put me in a little tortilla, huh? cover me in salsa, give me the story about Taquito Kitchen. So the idea was to deliver a Mexican experience, Mexican inspired, but with a contemporary urban touch. Taquito means little taco. Oh. More importantly means I can eat more of them. Yes. Because they're smaller. There you go. Makes you Chicago's best. Every single tortilla is handmade. But what makes it special? The hibiscus tortilla. Say what? <laughs> hibiscus infused. The tortilla itself is colored purple. Yeah, it's purple. Literally a purple tortilla shell. You guys do some crazy fun fusion, right? Uh, crispy fish is one of our most popular on the menu. The skirt steak taco with a chimichurri sauce. The Alaskan king crab. You're killing me here. I can't make any decision to save my life. Thankfully, because of them, one in particular from Michael said your fish tacos are incredible. I would put that fish taco against any fish taco in the city of Chicago. Don't take this the wrong way. You're clearly not the chef here. You're far too relaxed. True. <laughs> Absolutely true. Who's the chef? Gustavo Urbano. Listen to this, this voice. I'm going to go find <laughs> Chef Gustavo. Think tacos. Think tacos. This is Chef Gustavo. You're the maker of the tacos. Absolutely. And no taco can start without foundation. This is gonna be a hibiscus masa, which gives us a great color for the tortilla. I'm easily distracted, so anything colorful, that, that grabs my attention. Well, let's make this masa. Hibiscus going in. Pull it out to check it. It's a little, a little sticky. It's his fault. He's the chef here. Don't always blame me. So we need to take this upstairs? We do. I got we don't actually that. have to take it up. We can put it into a smaller bowl. And cool, yeah, let's do that. You're an idiot. I'm gonna make one tortilla for you. You're gonna make the rest for us. Yeah, the guy thinks I've never made tacos before in my life. Nice. Now we're gonna make the fish. Right, right. Go inside our taco. Right. Okay, is that guy threatening me? I will throw down with any dude for tacos. You're Don't fine. make me stop. Don't, you're, you're lucky he's holding me back, bro. All right, let's focus on the fish tacos. We slice up some tilapia and add Taquito Kitchen's special seasoning. Maybe a little bit more aggressively. <laughs> yeah, you guys are asking for it. Aggressive, aggressive dusting. <laughs> we finish dusting with rice flour, a little spritz of water, and it's time for the fryer. I want these little babies to have a safe journey, because I'm a hungry boy. While Gustavo builds us up, I'm gonna go talk to some taco enthusiasts. What I really liked about the fish tacos is it was like really light. It's not too fried. One of the lightest fish tacos I've ever had. The Mexican, I haven't had tacos like that. Each taco bite was so good. All together, just a very good taco. More fish tacos! More fish tacos! <laughs> Should we dive in? Yes. Because what? I'm dying. The hibiscus tortilla, how about that? I can't think of any other taqueria, any other joint around Chicago that's flavoring their tortillas. But that's a great fresh flavored fish. And with that light dusting that we did, yes. it's impeccable. Mario, what does the sign say out the front of your restaurant? If eating tacos is wrong, I don't want to be right. And you know what? The right thing to do is to share this love with my buddy Gustavo. <laughs> Take a bite, feel the love. So the love. 